What up, YouTube? PN100 here, man. I uh, got an update on that 1987 Chevrolet Caprice Classic LS Broham. It's my first Broham Bill box Chevy. I always want to do one, but as I said, I couldn't find any in good condition. Finally found one in good condition. My last video I showed of the car, uh, we was doing the body work on the car, so we finished painting the car now. And uh, yeah, here you go, man, without further ado. We got a lot more to do. We got to do the audio in it. We got to do the ends and odds to it. But for the most part, the um, the paint job's done. And here she go. 1987 Chevrolet Caprice Classic. Got the grill out where the Tierra grill is going to go. And uh, I just want to go back original because I believe a lot of these cars are going back to their original state. I did a lot of candy in a lot of cars. I did this. But I, I, I've been, I'm trying to get back to doing classic cars the way they were from the Chevrolet dealerships. So that I'm trying to do these old cars now that when you get one, I want it to be just like a brand new car. To all you got to do is say so the car is clean, all I got to do is just put wheels on it if you want to do that. You know, and go from that level. But I just believe a lot of the, the crazy designs and putting all kinds of symbols on the cars or just going out of style like bowling ball paint jobs and whatnot but it's to each his own all that stuff looks nice so keep doing what you're doing i just like to do them like this to just represent the era of when the car came out so here she goes 1987 and like i said man this car was a really nice car when i bought the car and uh, had 49,000 original miles as you can see the engine bay is just really nice all the stuff is original. If I wind up having the car a little longer, but we're gonna go inside and we're gonna change a lot of this stuff. We're gonna freshen it up. All this old stuff actually gotta come out, but it's not in bad condition. I'm just showing you guys raw footage of the car before I do all my last touches to it. But this will be the last on the car before I do the audio, and I'm going to the audio system next and whatnot. But yeah, here she go, man. Just walking around real quick, little quick walk around. Just look at this car, man. You know, the interior is just flawless. And that's another reason why I bought the LS Broham. Because, like I said, I want to do one. Just couldn't find one in good condition. So when I found this one, I was like, yeah, you know, that's where I want to be at. Where it's just a really nice mint car. I just like to do them the way they're supposed to be done the right way. Of course, you know, the, the trunk is going to change. I thought I put that... The noise in there because it is a Chevrolet box Chevy. I'm gonna turn it into a boom box. Hint box Chevy boom box. We don't have no time for no jokes right now, but yeah. It's really nice. Of course, you're not allowed to keep the original stickers up under there and everything. And it's a really nice car. Get inside this car, man. Just give me a little quick look at Aaron. Yeah, man, she is. She is just really, really, really gorgeous. And I always liked the, the tones of the, the, what they call Merlot Burgundy, if you will, or whatever you want to call it. Let me go check that side of the car a little more. Clear that glove compartment. Let you see the condition of this car so that you'll appreciate what's going on. Those are the GM, original GM floor mats. The GM logos on them, both sides. Really nice car. Like I say, 49,000 original miles. Really, really nice car. But the paint job came out just, I mean, hands down, just really, really wonderful. Let you see the miles on it. 49,000 original miles, man. Come on. I mean, the car speaks for itself. It speaks for itself. So we're gonna walk around a little bit and just Okay, so the doors, let's see how them doors go. Let's do them jams. Let's do them jams. Listen to that. Listen to them jams. Oh. <laughs> oh. Let me go that one. Huh? Come on, man. Play with it. Play with it, though. Woo. Man, look at him, man. This car going to be a lot of problems for a lot of people because it's just going to be so original, nice, clean cars. It's going to be a really nice build. You know, 
Gonna go with the 26s on there. Put the jewelry on there as far as the grill go. Finish it up, but I hope this 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 iPhone is just actually giving you the full view of what I'm getting so right now. Look at that. Just look at that. Look at that car. Wampa fillers are in the correct spots. Everything's lined up right. All the gaps are where they should be. Yeah, man. Look at that. 1987 Chevrolet Caprice Classic Broham. Uh, Brom. A lot of people say Broham is Brom. So it's a Chevrolet Caprice Classic Brom LS. With the half a top. That's how you know when you got that there less. And that's what you really want. You know, those hard tops. Box Chevys are nice. But everybody knows the trophy with this shit. It's the LS Brom. The Brom. The Broham. Whatever you want to have it. You know, we country around here. So, you know how it go. But yeah, that's it, man. Coming soon. More updates coming. Pin 100 subscribe. Yes, sir. She's coming along.